Welcome to the wonderful world of chemistry. Today, with the help of the coloring set by Mel Chemistry, we will learn what colors make up black marker dye. Perform this experiment on the plastic tray to contain any possible spills. Don't forget to put on protective gloves and goggles before doing the experiment. To open a bottle containing a reagent, push the cap down and turn it. Pierce the bottle nozzle with an unbent paper clip. For the chromatography experiment, you will need the sodium hydrogen sulfate solution, the black marker, filter paper, the petri dish, and a cotton cylinder from your experiment kit. First, take a piece of filter paper. Using the marker, draw and color in a small circle on the filter paper. Make the circle about one centimeter, a bit less than half an inch in diameter. Put the filter paper in the petri dish. Now, take the cotton cylinder and drip sodium hydrogen sulfate solution onto one end. Keep going until the solution starts dripping from the other end of the cylinder. Set the damp cylinder in the center of the black circle. The black circle will separate into colored rings. You will get your final result in approximately 10 minutes. You can make black by mixing several dyes. The liquid from the cotton cylinder spreads through the filter paper, taking the dyes with it. The different colors of dye, making up the black dye, all interact with the solution and the filter paper differently. Some of them move through the filter paper more quickly, while others take their time. We can exploit this property to separate the black dye into its components and observe chromatography in action. Learn more about this experiment on our Mel Science website.